her face was just open. It was just hanging. And at first I thought it was fake. It's a miracle 12-year-old Caress Patton is alive and able to speak about the horror she endured at her front door Monday night. The doorbell rang. A woman came barreling in. Her face was full of blood. Then the unthinkable. And I saw the gun, so I had to close the door. And when I closed the door, he shot through it. Caress was shot three times, twice in her right leg, once in her right hand. And she is one of this man's two alleged shooting victims that night. His name is Thomas Hutchins. He's 39 years old and a 14-year veteran deputy with the Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office, who was off duty that night. His head is bandaged in this mugshot, his face bloody. He told police that is why he fired shots, because the woman and mother of their child allegedly hit him over the head with a candlestick holder. He then told police, I saw blood running from my face and feared for my safety. I discharged my service weapon one to two times and left. But what he didn't mention was anything about chasing the woman into Patton's apartment or firing again, hitting this child, a child whose mother can't even fathom his position. This is a police officer. This is someone we're supposed to call for help to help us. And my daughter got shot in the result of it by his hand. That's not holy at all. What is holy is this. I didn't know he was like that. So I just tell God I forgive him. In Milwaukee, Ashley Berry, 10 at 10.